just an idea, like a spirit that comes and goes. It came to the land where the people read books and where the wise eyes teach the new eyes about life, about people, about plants, about myths, about animals, and about many other things. The elephant enjoyed seeing the new eyes learning and growing to become wise eyes, and it enjoyed, <laughs> and it enjoyed hearing the questions and feeling the passion of the people from this land. But the elephant knew that between the books and the wisdom, there were a big number of rules and taboos that were still unspoken and powerful. The elephant saw that some books would only talk of plants and animals, and others would only talk of people. The elephant saw that the wise eyes didn't understand each other, and were forgetting to teach the new eyes how to understand each other. A big division existed between those who understood the books of people, and those who understood the books of plants and animals. So, the elephant went to find the new eyes, and told them about the world. It told them that in the world, in, in the world, plants, people, animals, myths, all lived together. The new eyes understood that it was time to understand each other and to reach, read each other's books. They built an elephant so that the wise eyes and the new eyes would never forget to work together and read each other's books. And then the elephant was built, and wise eyes and new eyes danced together under the full moon, and the new year began. Thank you. 